Look at this guy getting down and dirty in his car. Holy shit! Holy Ready? Watch. <laughs> okay. Good morning, guys. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic morning, fantastic day, fantastic evening, wherever you guys are. I'm actually headed to Audi right now. I'm almost there picking the R8 up. They took the scratches off. Everything's good. I'll go in details with what they do, but I'm actually picking the R8 up and heading to the airport. Damon's landing. I'm actually kind of late, so I will update you guys in a bit. Oh my God, that's a C63 Black Series, guys. I want one of those so bad. Oh wow, they're actually gone. Cool. Alright, well, they actually fixed it. Damon's about to land any minute, so I'm actually headed to the airport. All right, guys, we just left the airport. Picked this guy up. What uh, up? Where we're we're going? gonna change it from the car biz to uh, the car pickup biz. <laughs> or something. I'm just making up bad, bad business names. Don't ever name a business that. Well, I wanted Daily Exotics. <laughs> See, before I didn't, I had no clue what the YouTube game was. I didn't know anything, and I'm like, I want Daily Exotics. And then I'm like, wait a minute, isn't that guy with the wrapped Horicon? And then I looked it up, and I'm like, yeah, it is. <laughs> So where are we going? We're heading to VF Engineering, right? VF Engineering. And what are we doing? My car's getting an exhaust put on. It's uh, a custom titanium exhaust by oh, wow. B Rogue Built, oh, which wow. is out of Chicago. The guy's name is Brandon. Builds these amazing custom titanium exhausts. So he preheated the tips so they were blue and purple because titanium changes color. I think oh, nice. It's under yeah, 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 yeah. And so the rest of the exhaust wasn't preheated, so it's still all like silver looking. However, the second we put heat into it, it's gonna start to change color. Oh, now, wow. most people, I've never seen a video on the internet of an exhaust changing Forget color video. before. I haven't your eyes. even heard of that. Really? Yeah, that's crazy. I know, so that's what I can't wait. I'm excited. Wow. I'm actually really stoked. Guys, we just got to VF Engineering. Let's go check his exhaust out. I am so excited for him. So we have Mike from VF Engineering. What are we doing? We're gonna. I need a software in your car so I could check my library to see if I have a software file for your car. All right, that sounds like fun. <laughs> All right, so what, what did you guys just do to my car? So we just flashed it with uh, hex tuning. Our ECU flash, it's an OBD2 port flash. Uh, it doesn't require moving the ECUs or anything, it's just all through all through the plant. Yeah, I mean, it's been, what, five minutes and you guys are done? <laughs> yeah, like, literally, I pulled in the car and they're like, oh, we're done. I mean, how crazy is that? Yeah. So, power, what am I going to... On this car, uh, the standard model car is uh, five, It's rated at 540 crank horsepower yeah, from yeah, the factory. Correct. But we take it to the equivalent of right around where the Huracan Perfumante is at, oh, which wow. is about 630. Oh, wow. So, for a naturally aspirated car, a 90 horsepower improvement oh, is obscene. And you so usually don't... You usually don't get those kind of gains out of a natural aspirator car, but Audi actually took power away from the standard model so they can differentiate the plus model yeah. versus the standard model car. Because yeah. according to Damon, it's all the same power plant. It's literally the same engine in all these cars. It is, yeah. It's yeah. the same 5.2 liter V10 engine. Uh, the architecture is all the same throughout. Um, the differentiator on all of the different models is primarily in the software. I can't wait to drive this thing right now. That's going to be fun. So around 630 horsepower. Yeah. Wow, fun. that is crazy. Thank you so much, guys. Yeah, you're Thank welcome, you. Man. Appreciate Enjoy. it, man. Let's go drive it. All right, guys. So this thing is pushing 630 horsepower. How crazy is that? From 540 to 630. I can't wait to drive this. So that is insane. It's insane. It's really cool what they can do. Oh yeah. It's And you know what? It's the fact that they understand that the power plant in this car mm -hmm. is the same power plant in all the other models. Oh, yeah. They just severely detune it. So it's kind of neat. It's like you got all the parts there. But it's just, just like tweak. Locked. Yep. Let's, Let's unlock it. So he pretty much said this is like as fast as like sort of a performante because it's 630 horsepower. Yeah. Dude, it's nuts. That's crazy. It's nuts. I can't wait to drive it. Let's check it out. 3,200 miles. Damn, that's crazy. This is the very first time with the tune. Oh yeah, it's faster. 
<laughs> oh yeah. This is definitely... That's a significant wow. difference in power, bro. <laughs> you like it? Oh yeah, dude. Crazy, right? <laughs> you feel the pull? The pull is like, oh! It's sweet, because you get like no wheel spin. All wheel drive. Let's try that. I'm gonna go to first gear. That is sick. It really wakes it up. Like 80 like horses, a lot yeah. of horsepower. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's insane. It just here it's like a little louder. Right? It could be. So we're launching straight into launch lunch control. time. Right into lunch. Yeah. This is how we get lunch. Yeah. Holy shit! <laughs> Alright guys, just took this thing out for a spin and it was just insane. We had a quick lunch and I feel like it's a different car. I swear to god, it does not it does not feel like it's it's my R8. It's completely completely different. What do you think? I'm so excited. Look, dude, look, look, look I love look, look. it. This is amazing. I wasn't, I told him I wasn't a fan of how it looked last week, but this is just like, it looks perfect. It looks like the car's like made to look like this. Like how, how crazy is that? It's crazy. Huge, huge Stupid. shout out to VF. I'm going to leave all their links, their Instagram, their website. I'm even going to put their address in the description <laughs> below. Definitely check them out. But don't, but don't show up without an invite. <laughs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta call them. You gotta, busy doing yeah, this yeah, stuff all they're, day. they're pretty busy. And you definitely gotta follow them on Instagram because yeah. they have all sorts of cool stuff like they dyno supercars, they dyno high-end luxury sedans. So they have lots of really cool content all the time. Nick's always handing out secret missions. They always have guest uh, appearances by all oh, yeah. sorts of people. I'm actually gonna bring the green G63, drop it off by Nick, and I'm gonna take his C63 because he's gonna start. He wants to. Really? What, what do you want to do to the G wagon? I think we'll turn up the dial on the turbos. Okay. <laughs> Give it some more power, some more torque. <laughs> <laughs> like it doesn't need it. <laughs> but uh, I think it's gonna really wake that up, just like. Oh yeah. Right. Oh yeah. Oh, that's gonna be awesome, guys. So stay tuned. Guys, check out these new wheels they're about to put on their C63. Look how nice this C63 is. What color is this? It's pretty crazy. Look at this guy getting down and dirty in his car. Nobody's supposed to know. Oh, I'm sorry. Only your vlog knows. Okay, I'm okay. 
put on gloves and do stuff. All right. Off camera, everything's bought, not built. Okay. Guys, don't tell anybody. Yeah, we gotta keep this our secret. <laughs> First rule about daily driven exotics: so don't talk about daily driven exotics. <laughs> By the way, this is OEM Lamborghini Black. Oh yeah, it is. Damn, you're getting pretty serious out here. I go all out at DD. Look at that. He's trying to fit okay. those in there. Ready? Watch. <laughs> Just joking. Psych. <laughs> so the trick is the first one. God, it has to get like, kind of like that. It's good to know because I will definitely be in a situation like this in the near future since the tires are the identical size on my car. Yeah. These are nice. Yeah, they were nice. Oh, you think no. they grip better than my Pirellis? Uh, what type of what Pirellis do you have? P0? Yeah. I mean, with came stock with the car. These will grip as good as a P0, last longer than a P0. No way. And they smoke better than a P0. So why did Audi put P0s on the R8? Because Audi has a deal with Pirelli. Yeah. <laughs> Just like Porsche has a deal with Michelin. Michelin. Conti's on actually a lot. They're on. Mercedes, mm -hmm. BMW. Mm -hmm. They want to know how you how, how, how you fit it in, Damon. <laughs> Damon, just dude, just put both tires here and I'll follow you if it falls. Hey, I'm serious, dude. Did I do this last time? I got him in there. I know I did. Yeah, you're I good. do remember knowing it was a bad idea how we did it. You're good. Thanks for the tune, and I'll see you next week with the G-Wagon. Very good. Drive safe. Woo! That sounded so good. How, how are you doing, Damon? Did you put it in right? Ooh, he did it. How do you feel? Exhausted. <laughs> how is he gonna drive? <laughs> all right, guys, we had loads of fun. My car is now pushing 630 horsepower. Look at this guy, he's all Nuts. tired. And hot and sweaty. Ooh. It sounds weird. <laughs> Even though no one saw me doing anything on camera. Well, no, it was, just, it was on your camera. Oh, I was they, outside. Yeah. On Everyone my over there, they, they know what you do. On my hands and knees. So they're, they're the only people that are gonna see that. Cleaning and painting things black with spray paint on a Lamborghini. I can see that every day. Someone just psh, 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 psh. Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. Please smash that subscribe button. Take it. Yeah, I don't even need to say anything. His expression says it all. S subscribe to me if you have it. Please do. And then please check out VF Engineering. I'm going to leave all their stuff in the description. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace.